Okay, I just, uh, Perfect. okay, sorry about that. Uh, had to make sure it was ticking. Well, we just saw the Blair Glitch Project. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just strange that the, the, the lead, uh, the lead character's name is Blair. <laughs> That's true. I think. I didn't uh, think of that. Okay, so uh, so we you normally do these. You can go first to say your uh, your thoughts. I gotta collect mine. It, it's, yeah. it's a heck of a movie. It I make, know. Make, make you I'm feel still trying to some things. I'm still trying to gather my thoughts too. This this is probably the craziest movie <laughs> in theaters right now, and <laughs> Furious Seven is playing. <laughs> it's uh, geez, well. Uh, well, I mean, it's, it's, if you just want to know, like, it's the kind of horror movie where it's just generally unsettling. Like, if, like, if you want to see it, like, like, not, ups, not in a bad way, but just, like, it wants to make you feel on the edge all the time. So if, if you like that kind of thing, you might like this. <laughs> it's a kind of movie where I'm kind of on the edge sometimes, and there are other times when I'm just like, how can I not laugh at such stupidity? <laughs> it's definitely, they did, uh, oddly enough, coming from someone who works in IT, they did a pretty decent job, the whole movie is a screenshot, I'd say, yeah, and, and but they did a pretty decent job, like, at all the websites look more or less like it's a real teenager using a computer, so that's a really unique... I've never seen that Yeah, definitely. Before. It is uh, it, it is a well-directed film in yeah. that sense. Oh, yeah, and, I guess uh, that would be direction. That's, it's a weird movie. Yeah. I mean, it's really unlike anything. Yeah. Well. And we get the twist at the end that it was not found footage after all. That... Yeah, they show the very last shot. I don't know if it's how relevant it is to the plot, but the very last shot is... You see a computer shut, so that's that's it's disconcerting. Her computer, yeah. It's disconcerting when you're because you're looking at the same computer screen. The movie takes place all um, like time. It's in real time. There's no cuts or anything. It's all like yeah. that. I guess the movie's probably about an hour and a half. So the move, the what happens yeah. in the movie is about an hour and a half. Yeah, this film actually is uh, one long take in one house. Yeah. yeah, I mean, you see glimpses of other people's house through cameras. Yeah. Although um, although the the sound is obviously edited and amplified because a lot of the uh, the Skype content um is to totally loud. Yeah. For, no, I it's mean it would not. <laughs> it's it's a little. I think in the theater specifically, they had the sound up really loud. The, the trailers were, gosh, there's just constant startles throughout all the yeah. trailers. And the trailers were, I feel like, longer than normal. But I could just be because it was just unsettling. <laughs> and so um, the sound was up really loud. You could hear there was... It, at first you're like, oh, is the movie just them talking and just their computers making noise? Because she plays music at the beginning. And it's like, oh, is the soundtrack just going to be the music she plays? But they... Maybe they want you to feel that way and not notice when they play loud noises or when they play, like, deep bass. Like, he said it was like a plane taking off. <laughs> yeah, it's, I can agree with that. <laughs> whenever uh, whenever you're supposed to get the sense that uh, the the ghost is is about to uh, strike, it plays that uh, that noise that vibrates the theater. It's like the, the sound that you hear when... Uh, when a demon approaches in the Paranormal Activity movies. They play, and it's kind of like the soundtrack to Interstellar a little bit. Like, it gets you, like, down deep in yeah. your chest. Although this movie, at first, wanted to make it seem like they didn't really have a soundtrack. Like, there's no outside movie things coming into the movie. But they, they, they couldn't fool me. <laughs> <laughs> they, they definitely, they played some, there were a few times where there's stuff happened and they just, nothing actually made a noise. But the soundtrack made a really loud one to make you feel it. Um... Yeah. But I mean, the, I, as far as that goes, it's, I don't know, it was better in the trailers for sure, as far as jump scares go. Yeah. Um, I yeah, guess, I, oh, go ahead. Okay. I, I was going into this expecting either something, uh, I, I was thinking that uh, this film might have, might work if it was like a satire on the horror found footage genre. Sometimes it kind of feels like it Sometimes is. Sometimes it does feel like it is. It's like but... uh, it's like taking the uh, 
the thought literally that um when you do all this uh this junk and put it online and uh talk uh talk rumors about somebody or stuff like that it's going to come back to haunt you and i don't think that yeah. concept will go away like this would that would fit well with like a serious drama like yeah. and they kind of have done internet horror movies before i don't know this is really the only one that you could even sort of take moderately seriously as a movie we're seeing um do we do spoilers do you avoid spoilers generally um, Well, I guess uh, we should try to avoid it. Okay. But um, so I'll say, I'll say, at one point they kind of allude to that it's a bad idea, but I can tell you the whole movie takes place with some friends on Skype. Basic, yeah, it's Skype, yeah. and and they like, none of them really like attempt to physically leave. Like a couple times, some people do, and then they like people end up trapping themselves in rooms further inside their house, and then one character kind of makes. A play to go outside but I, I would say that's one thing that I'm a little confused why like near the beginning uh, there's a whole thing going on trust me it's not good if you were there you'd want to get out yeah. and like people make less of an effort to physically remove themselves like run to their neighbor's house than, than you might think and so that's maybe something yeah. that I could Character's motivation is a little confusing there. <laughs> that, that's just, just for me. Um, well, well, especially the lead, uh, the 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 lead character's motivations are confusing. Um, they're because the ghost always sends like these links to uh, videos containing uh, containing their secrets, and um, and even at one point, uh, Ken he he tells um. Yeah. He tells Blair, don't click on it, don't click on it. Every time, like a moth to flame, she clicks on it. Yeah, she did, she clicked on it. <laughs> yeah. Although, one of the characters then said, on their screen, I can't stop it or something, so maybe yeah. it downloaded But then no one ever really mentioned it. Sometimes it downloads itself, but... <laughs> oh, you know what, it didn't, because... Because it comes up, what she did click on comes up later, and characters weren't aware of it. So, so I guess she just was... I don't know. She, the characters themselves, I, I are relatable maybe to some teenagers. I mean, they weren't. I wouldn't say it's it's a little bit of the horror movie trope where they're get they're like annoying, like annoying teenage. <laughs> but I did, They were funny. They were relatable in at yeah. times. They definitely they weren't well behaved <laughs> yeah. in, in any manners of their lives. <laughs> uh, but I mean, I guess you don't expect teenagers to be. So it depends. Yeah. Although they all seemed older than teenagers, now that I think about it. I think everyone in the movie was older than me, and I'm 20. So, <laughs> I don't know. But we'll, we'll just accept that they're in high school. Well, you seem to be taking this movie more seriously than I am. <laughs> I know. Oh, it's hard. Um, I, the, I mean, there, there are moments, especially when uh, the, the ghost just starts playing calming music that have lyrics that just kind of relate to what's going on. Like, uh, like some song about lying. I don't even remember what it was. When a character lies, though, yeah. So, I mean, yeah. the, it's basically, it's a ghost that uh, can do whatever it wants, yeah. basically. It can it can do anything, but it's having yeah. fun messing with the lead characters. Yeah. There's even, a, it gets to the point where the ghost starts playing Never Have I Ever with them. <laughs> yes, and that, well, I mean, and... not even, that's like a significant plot point, that whole, that's like 20 minutes of the movie. I'd say. Yeah. Um, well, I'll say. It's and so it does. It does a countdown with them, um, to get the person that it that it has in mind to admit uh, the stuff that uh, that he or she did to her in real life. And and okay. uh, <laughs> there's so much going on that y you just can't think. It's. Uh, all I could do was just laugh. <laughs> it's I'm running out of time, but so I'll can I summarize my thoughts? I, I yeah I suppose. I'd like I to thought this was gonna turn into a longer one. No, but I, 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 go, I, so. no I yeah I wish I could stay longer. I'm gonna try and make it for more of these. Yeah. So I don't I don't want to cut anyone. But uh so basically, I I liked the way they film I filmed it. I don't know. I kind of yeah. I liked the way the movie was laid out. I thought it was neat and they did a really good job with it. Uh, in the end, I agree with that too. Yeah. Yeah. In the end, it's a little, 
like it's just for me it was i don't know if i want to say silly. like it's 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 a horror movie. like the yeah. deaths are exaggerated for not really any explain like it doesn't the ghost doesn't really have motivations to do that just to be mean like yeah. it's it's so at the in the end it's definitely a silly movie like no one it, it's silly but i mean there, it is unique like it's i'll give i'll give it what it, you know what it deserves and it definitely is i it's really it's not like any movie i've seen as far as the way it's put together and it's a legitimate I mean, she view of what a computer screen is actually like. So in that way, like they do some boring things, like just like at the beginning, download things and click on things. Yeah. And for some reason, like I, you're not bored by it. Like you're kind. Of, I was interested. I'm like, oh, this is. I can do this on a computer too. I don't know. <laughs> it stuck with me in that way. What do you What do you think? Yeah, uh, yeah. Those those uh, those are kind of my thoughts on it too. It's uh, it's um, it's it's very well uh, directed and uh. But it, it it had me laughing though, and I'm I still am not sure if that's what in, it intended. I, I'm doubting it was, but but I would kind of recommend it. Uh, it's probably among the uh, the middling films that are out this year. Yeah, I if horror movies are your genre then this one is i probably better than than a lot that at least, that i've seen at least it's not like l despite what i said about like it just personal preference it, the sort of the startling and stuff it's it cuz it gets to me and so i don't love horror movies this kind of horror movie because definitely like personal preference so if you don't like being startled a lot or whatever it's not like this movie's terrible but it'll get to you a little bit but um i'd say if it's definitely, as far as horror movies go, it's one of the better ones I've seen, especially of this sort of type of, like, teenage uh, blo uh, blockbuster horror movie, for sure. You're definitely better at uh, coming up with words to say quicker than I am. Than I do. <laughs> Sorry, okay, it's well, a habit um, of mine. I would like to address a few of the trailers. There was the one that, uh, that actually kind of had me shaking. The gallows. Oh yeah, that, geez. It it looks like it's another found footage movie. It's all it is is some girl trapped in a room that's red tinted, and and she's crying, and like the, the first shot, you you gradually start to see this figure to her left just move move slowly closer and closer. You not even really walk, just kind of slide in. Yeah. And the only jump scare in the whole thing is just some part where a rope grabs her neck, and it, and it, it's, but it's the whole thing's red. Did you mention how red it was? Yeah, 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 it's red, and it's all in one room. I have no idea what that's about, but it looks frightening. Yeah, I mean, if that's one, that's one just from the trailer. I know I wouldn't be able to handle. Well, so I don't think I'll be seeing that one, but. Yeah. I can if that's your thing. I you probably pretty excited by the trailer. I yeah. can imagine. And speaking of found footage, it looks like M Night Shyamalan is doing one of those too. Yeah, which had, looked also very freaky. But uh, yeah, maybe not. The visit is yeah. his next film, and uh, we keep thinking uh, maybe this will be the one that uh, Shyamal the the one that Shyamalan does right for once since uh, it's Sixth to Sense tell. or Unbreakable or whatever. It's tough to tell. The trailers always look good for his movies. Like the trailers never look yeah. bad, so it's 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 hard to tell <laughs> really what's gonna become of it. <laughs> yeah. Well, I always look forward to a Shyamalan movie when it comes out because, uh, I mean, with uh, the happening and whatnot, I'm I'm always interested to find out how he's doing. <laughs> yeah. I mean, well, yeah, it's. The trailer made it look it, it look it looked decent. It looked like it could really go somewhere, but again, that's a Shyamalan thing. They always look like they're going to go somewhere. I bet people were excited to see The Last Airbender when before they knew how bad it was. Yeah. So, <laughs> it's 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 a tough call to make at this point. I, I I it was intriguing. I'll say it's intriguing. Yeah. Okay, well, I think I ought to wrap it up. This this might be our uh, my shortest discussion yet, but it all also might be my favorite. Yeah, normally <laughs> Just, I'd like uh, to stay for longer. 
Yeah. Goodbye. Uh, yeah. I'll try and make more of these in the and, future. And uh, next week, uh, it'll probably be the age of Adeline. But uh, there's also Little Boy coming out. Little Boy looks dumb, but it also might make for another fun discussion. Maybe. Yeah. Okay. So, uh, all right, see you next time. I'm a little afraid to log off. <laughs> You know, I'm seriously. just turning off a video. I, I wonder like if it'll let me turn off. Anymore. <laughs> okay, so uh, uh, leave a comment. Let me know if it's not turning off. <laughs>